Looking for the cheapest coins on the internet right now? Look no further than my sponsor, Mutt Coin Bank, guys. You seriously cannot beat that value. I promise. Use code Poodle for 5% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm going to be going over all upcoming April Mutt content, guys. Yes, today is March 30th, which means that April is coming up in approximately, what, two days? We have 31 days this month, so... April's coming in two days. Gonna drop this video now. No content today, of course, so it's the perfect day to drop it. Maybe we'll get some more Easter slash egg stuff coming in the next few days. So I figured today was the perfect day to do this video. Now, the thing is, guys, with April, you, it's hard to compare it to last year. So there's some promos that are set in stone, right? Like Christmas promo will be in December. NFL draft promo will be in April. Um, team of the year will more than likely be in January. Team of the week will start the first week of the NFL season. And there's other promos, right? Like positional heroes, and there's other promos like you know rising stars or any of that stuff like we don't know when it can come in they, they, there's no set timeline right like mud heroes like it is not a seasonal promo it's just a madden promo so some promos we know some promos are going to be you know kind of a guess like we did so some promos we got in march that haven't happened yet so we're like okay that's probably pushed back to april but then some promos we didn't even get last year went into april and you know march so it's kind of like okay so we're getting that here so maybe they're pushing these back maybe they're eliminating we just don't exactly know, right? And that's kind of been the nature of this year. This year's been weird. Because last the issue with this year is that last year, they deprived us so much. Like, they took away so much stuff that we're used to that we came into this year expecting literally nothing. And we get a lot more. So now it's kind of like, huh, how are they trying to play us, right? Uh, what's the gimmick here? We're, we're, we don't trust them anymore. But besides the point, guys, before we get into the video, make sure you go below, hit that subscribe button. Give this video a big thumbs up. Let me know down below what's going on, guys. What's your biggest promo left in this year of Madden that you're still expecting? Like, is it positional heroes? Is it program stars? Is it, you know, is it, is it uh, standouts? You know, is is there one specific thing that you really would just like to see in this game? Like, no, if any, nothing else came out, what would it be? And if you guys need coins, head over to Muck Coin Bank down below. And make sure to always use code Poodle at checkout for 5% off your order. Yeah, that's about it. So let's head on over, guys. Let's go look at some of the promos that are still upcoming. And off with the first promo that we do expect is going to be... The NFL Draft promo. Now, these aren't really in any order specifically, but it's going to be in April. I believe last year was April 15th it came out in Madden. So, this was it. So, guys, there's like three parts of the draft promo. First, there's the players that are drafted, right? So, it goes in order of everyone. So, obviously, the first overall pick, Joe Burrows, and then overall. Second overall pick, oh, sorry, third overall pick, Joe Okuda. Uh, sorry, Jeff Okuda. Chase Young was the second overall pick. Andrew Thomas was the fourth overall pick. Tua Tagovailoa was the fifth overall pick. CJ Henderson was the ninth. And again, it all goes overalls go in order just about from when they were drafted. So we're in the 97 range. Now we got Isaiah Simmons at eight, Derek Brown at seven, Jedrick Willis at 10, Justin Herbert at six. Um, we got Dermon Arnett. So now we're in the 96s, right? So obviously these are out of order because it's going in overall range. So as long as they're all 96s, they're going to all be, you know, regardless of pick in there. But as you guys can see, pretty much we went up to about, I believe, pick 10. Pick 10 is where they get the cutoff for 97 overalls. And then picks 11 through, I believe, around like 20 or 96 and so on and so forth. Right, CD Lamb. So you guys get the point. In real life, Trevor Lawrence is going to get 99 overall. Um, mo oh, probably all the four quarterbacks are going to be 98 and above. Like, if we get Trevor Lawrence first, Zach Wilson second, followed by, you know, uh, potentially, what's his name? Uh, ooh. Zach Wilson, Trevor Lawrence. We got Trey Lance as the fourth one. Wow. Zach Wilson, Trevor Lawrence, Trey Lance, Justin Fields, right? I believe those are the four quarterbacks. Like they could all be all they could all be gone by top five or six. So more than likely, three out of the four quarterbacks will be 98 or above, and then the one of them will be 97. More than likely, they're all gonna be gone in the top 10, I believe. So I do expect something like that, but that's pretty much it for that part of the draft promo. Then we got the other part, which is actually going to be players that have been drafted in the past, which is every player just about ever. So we got Cam Newton as the you know former first overall pick. Peyton Manning, we got Miles Garrett. This is going to be like kind of flashbacks to old big, you know, draft night players. Logan Mankins, Greg Olson. We'll get some undrafted players in there, like, you know, guys who had a great career and they went undrafted. We'll get late round guys, mid round guys, early round studs to Marius Randall, Harrison Smith, Lakin Tomlinson, Jimmy Smith, Calvin Ridley, Jabril Peppers, David DeCastro, Evan Ingram. A lot of first round picks here. Bud Dupree, Darnell Savage Jr., Frank Ragno. Juwan James, Adoree Jackson, CJ Mosley, Brian Burns, and then of course a few more guys. We go down to about 96 here, I believe. Nope, only 97. Okay. We got Jason Pierre Paul, Malcolm Jenkins, Darren Payne, Odell Beckham Jr., JJ Watt, Todd Gurley, Anthony Barr, Roquan Smith, Adrian Peterson, Leonard Williams, Patrick Peterson, AJ Green, Anthony Munoz, some legend, some legend draft players in there too, which is pretty cool. And Von Miller. So guys, that, that's a really good drop of cards. Like right? those are some good, good cards. And we have some more stuff too, guys. Then we have the draft picks. 
these were collectibles that also could play so these are plays that you could play in your lineup but they're also collectibles so this was the first overall pick if you got enough of these first overall pick cam newtons i think it was two of them you were able to build 99 overall first overall pick joe burrow right or something like that a 99 overall first overall pick cam newton master so you needed these picks and then pick five was patrick peterson aj green was pick four anthony munoz was pick three von miller's pick two Todd Gurley was pick 10 anthony barr was pick nine roquan smith is pick eight Adrian Peterson was pick 7, Leonard Williams at 6, Frank Ragnall 20, Juwan James 19. Also, it gives you some draft knowledge, right? Because sometimes it's like, okay, yeah, like you're an NFL fan, but you, you're not a draft guy, right? You're not a big college football, then watch the draft guy. You just watch the NFL. So you're like, oh, yeah, you know, I'm a big fan of, uh, you know, Leonard Williams. He's doing really good for the Giants. He was pick 6 overall by the Jets, if you guys don't remember. CJ Mosley was a 17th overall pick. And sometimes you get to see, like, wow, these guys are pretty late. Like, you look at a guy like Odell. He, he was pretty good, right? And the Giants at, the, at first, right? He picked 12. Not bad. J.J. Watt was pick 11. Like, you thought maybe he would have went higher. You go on down. You see Lakin Tomlinson, 28. So, he was a back of a first-round pick. Jabril Peppers was pick 25. Evan Ingram was 23. Darnell Savage was 21. You have to get a pretty good look at who was picked where. And then, finally, guys, going on over, we have Golden Tickets. So, Golden Tickets, again, was a March promo last year. But because of, like, what I said with promos being pushed back, because we got, we got a few extra promos, right? We got some promos this March, like uh, Mud Heroes, which was, like, late February, early March. We got Mud Heroes. We got the all rookie promo in February. A few promos I think that we got or in Easter a little bit earlier than usual because Easter last year came out as of I believe today or tomorrow, like the 31st, 30th. So pretty much as you guys can see there, that's that's pretty much a wrap up of what I'm trying to say. So golden tickets last year would have came out around like March 6th or at least announced on March 6th. We have we have nothing right. We're going to April about day and a half, two days. So pretty much golden tickets I think will be pushed back to April May the latest right but in years past golden tickets typically did come out in April and May so I kind of this kind of wraps it up to you know make sense now I can't imagine they're giving us all these extra promos this year and they're gonna steal one of the ones that we've been waiting for you know I'd rather lose three of these last at the end of the year promos for golden tickets it's one of the most fun promos it's one of the more interactive promos now last year guys you've seen this already we had Calvin Johnson Gentry Julio Jones Evans White Allen Mays Trey Edmonds Lamar Jackson Brian Bird, Muhammad Sanu Sr., Adrian Peterson, Heath Bullock, Jalen Ramsey, Palomalu, Cam Newton, Calvin Benjamin, Michael Vick, Dawkins, Barr, and a few more guys. We had a lot. Quincy Nunwa, Cravon LeBlanc, RG3, and Bo Jackson. Now, if you guys remember, every week was three drops. Well, three players, one drop. We got two user-created golden tickets and one developer. So, like, a developer that works for the Madden dev team could pick one. So, like, I know a few dev ones. So, I believe Quincy Nunwa was a dev one. I believe, uh, let's see, Mike Evans, I think, was a dev one. I could be wrong. Uh, Trey Edmonds, I think, was a dev one. Again, I, I could be wrong on all these guys. Don't, this is, there's a lot of them. Muhammad Sanu, I'm pretty sure, was dev. Uh, Keith Bullock was dev. I'm pretty sure... Kelvin Benjamin was dev. Uh, Anthony Barr was dev. So, you know, it was like, it was a ratio of two to one. So, you know, there wasn't a ton, but there was a, there was a good amount of them. But yeah, overall, golden tickets are fun. They're going to come out, I think, in April, at least by late April at the minimum. I mean, at the latest. And again, it could get pushed back into May. It depends. But I don't, I don't know how much May content we're going to have. So maybe that's why they push it back there. But then again, April is a pretty decent month of content with the draft alone. And then finally, guys, we've got Position Heroes. Position Heroes is another promo that we did expect from two years ago. Came out around March, April. So again, if they were going to bring it back, because it seems like they're bringing back a lot of promos this year that they did end up actually ditching from the last mat. Like, Madden 19 had a lot of them. Madden 20, they ditched a lot of them. So it seems like they're bringing a lot back. So they we're going to bring back position heroes, which like I told you guys, like team of the year 2.0. Team of the year gives like gave you all the best players left that needed cards, uh, you know, from top performances of the year. And then position heroes pretty much picks one player per each position, kind of like team of the year. And it's going to give you a bet, the, one of the like, 99 overall, 98 overall version of that position. And it's going to be players that need an upgrade, right? So let's say Russell Wilson got a team of the year quarterback. Then for quarterback, maybe they go with another guy now, right? Because Russell got his other card. So pretty much going to be wrapping up a bunch of current day players that never got upgrades. Like maybe, you know, Michael Thomas, you know. But again, guys, you won't get it probably. I think for in reality, they had to actually have had a good season. Right? Like Saquon can't get a card because these cards do have stats on them. So it's based off their season performances, which is why I said it's literally team of the year 2.0. But yeah, I expect that. So we'll have, you know, two wide receivers, a fullback, a halfback, quarterback, punter, safety. It's literally green. Call it green team of the year. It's green team of the year 2.0. But we get all 99 overalls this time. Definitely a fun promo, guys. We had so many good cards from this promo. If you look at the top from two years ago, we had, uh, what was it? T.Y. Hilton was really good. He had 99 speed powered up. We got Nick Chubb, who was decent. We had Russell Wilson, who was pretty good. We had Jamal Adams, who was insane. We had Jalen Ramsey, who was insane. Eddie Jackson, who was insane. We had Tredavious White, who was pretty good. We had uh, Leighton Van Der Esch, who was pretty decent at the time. Fletcher Cox was decent. Chris Jones was decent. Demarcus Lawrence was really good as well. It was, it was a really good promo, so hopefully they bring that back. 
But guys, that's pretty much it. We have a uh, we have the draft promo, which is going to be current draft players. We have the part where it's going to be past draft players. We have the part where it's going to be you know picks and collectibles for sets. We have golden tickets, and we do have positional heroes, guys. But that's about it for the video. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Turn that notification bell. Give this video a big thumbs up, as always. If you haven't already, comment down below. Let me know if you guys need any coins. I'll go ahead and over to CoinBank, uh, my CoinBank down below, and use code Poodle at checkout for 5% off your order. Thank you so much for watching. I'm out. Peace.